K babes and welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be a plan with me video as you can tell by the title. <laughs> I do not do too much planning throughout the week. I guess I do more on my computer than anything which I will explain further in the video but this video is probably going to be pretty short but I just thought I'd show you anyway because who doesn't love a good plan with me video? Alright, okay, so before we get on into the video, if you guys have not done so already, and if you guys are new, hi, my name is Michaela, and you should definitely hit that subscription button down below, as well as the notification bell that is right next to this subscription button, so that you get notified every single time I upload. And if you also have not done so already, give me a follow on Twitter, and let me know that you're following me. I would greatly appreciate that. So... Without further ado, let's just get right on into this plan with me video. Hey guys, I'm back. You just saw me like 2.0 seconds ago. Sorry, my throat has been so dry this week, so if I'm talking kind of funny, I apologize. So, we're going to do a plan with me. This is just plan with me for school and in life, I guess. I use two different things to plan, and I'm going to show you. The first thing that I use is my laptop. I use Google Calendar a lot of the times for either school related things, YouTube related things, work related things, life related things. I use it all on here. I don't put my homework on that because I don't, I put due dates on there so like if an exam is due, like in a week, I'll put I'll put when the exam is due, when I find out when the exam is due. So, yeah. And then the other thing, the next thing that I use is just this planner. This is what it looks like. It just says 2018 to 2019 on it. And it's like this, it's kind of like a composition notebook, but it has like a bookmark. A flag thing here and it just it's really I love this thing so much I saw it and I was like oh, I have to get it plus it's pink like this is probably my favorite color of pink like the baby pink you know what I mean at this point where when I fill out my planner for next week I have all my homework done I got all of it done I'm really happy I almost forgot to take a quiz online but we got that done I got one wrong but that's okay so at this point I always fill out my planner after I'm done with my homework it's usually the last thing I do because then I can also check off what I got done that day and make sure everything is checked off for the week and just make sure I don't have any homework for the weekend because nobody wants homework over the weekend am I right also, I apologize for the way I look again. I look like this last weekend, but you know what? I'm a college student. It happens. We don't always want to look cute all the time. So I'm here. I'm being real. Yes, I have Hallmark Christmas movies on in the background because they started today. Who else is excited about those? Because I am a diehard fan of Hallmark Christmas movies. And yes, I had to put that in here because, like I said, I'm a diehard Hallmark Christmas movie fan. Okay, let's just get started with showing everything. So, hang on. Okay, well, okay. First, I'm going to show you what this week has looked like. And it just looks like this. Hopefully, it's going to... Yeah. So, as you can tell, everything is checked off for the week and I have all my homework done which is really really good so I am going to prop the camera up and I'm going to write out my stuff for next week and then I'm going to show you what I do for my Google Calendar and how I set everything up for that
Okay guys, so now that we have all of that down, I'm going to show you what's on my computer and just how I fill all of that stuff out. So let's, let's do this. Okay guys, so this, this is my Google Calendar spread. As you can tell, the days past are shaded out a little bit. Like, you can tell like looking here and stuff, it's more clear and then it like blurs out the rest of the month, which is really nice. I already put in my work schedule for next week, so all I do is I click and then I can do more options and then I can type in all my information right here and so all I have this next week is I have to work 8 a.m. every single day and I have Friday off and then Google Calendar puts holidays in there for you obviously and then Wednesday I have to edit this video which is nice um, today the 26th I am filming this video <laughs> tomorrow my homework routine goes up. Check it out if you have not done so already. And yeah, so that's what that looks like. We're gonna continue. Oh, okay. Nope. Today, okay. We're gonna continue. This is November, so obviously we've got this week, which is fun to look at. And we have a blank month, which will be filled with all my work dates and stuff. And then I have Thanksgiving break off right here, which I don't work that week either and I have three full weeks until Thanksgiving break which is really awesome. The yellow, the yellow is school related. I don't know why but when I think of school I think of the color yellow probably because of the yellow school bus but um the color for school is yellow and on November 6th there is no classes being held however the campus is open so I probably will have to work that day but that's okay, because I think I'll be working in the morning, so I'll have the afternoons. I'll still have free time. No classes that day, and then I put in no classes, college closed for the three days off that I have over Thanksgiving. And I have these videos on the side on Saturdays. They are planned, they are what's going to go up in the next few weeks. Here I have like, this is for my web development class that I'm taking and this is when all the tutorials and homework assignments are due for my online classes. Usually each assignment is due on Sunday at midnight so I just put those in. I usually get it done all done on Thursday and then I take the quiz on Friday and then I have it done for the weekend and I don't have to worry about oh I need to turn this in it's almost midnight. You know what I mean? Those are there and yeah and then going on to december i have my 20th birthday i'm excited i have my birthday party which is going to be on the first and then the week of the 10th is finals so i put that down as well as when my class one of my classes is going to have a final exam so yeah um, so finals are this week and then this entire thing right here, this entire line of yellow is my Christmas break. So I start Christmas break on the 17th. I'll probably start earlier than that depending on what day my finals and my classes land on. I don't think I'll have a lot of finals. I honestly don't think I'll have any finals this, this semester which is Super nice. Semester break starts on the 17th and it ends on January 11th and then we go back to school on the 14th. So, and then I already have no classes on the 21st. So, that's awesome. So yeah, here's my calendar. All right guys, so I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, and question of the day. What do you guys do? When you plan out your weeks or month, do you use an app on your phone? Do you use an actual planner? Do you use um, an app, something on your computer, like a calendar or something? What do you do and what do you use for when you plan your week? I'd be 
very interested to know. So, yeah, I will talk to you guys in next week's video. Bye, guys.